We do have some breaking news we are following. We're going to tell you about that now. The Sewage and Water Board has issued a boil water advisory for residents east of the Industrial Canal. That would include Venetian Isles, Lake Catherine, and Irish Bayou. It does not, however, include the Lower Ninth Ward. Officials say a drainage pumping station in the east saw its pressure drop created by a combination of water main breaks and an increase in water use. Residents in the area are advised not to drink the water before boiling it. All right, well, good evening. Now, Mayor Mitch Landrieu has also had some words of warning at a press conference that was held earlier this afternoon. Carice Jackman was there and brings us more. Carice. Good evening, ladies. Yes, he is basically advising people to remember that this weather situation is not a joke. Please heed their warning. Stay inside if you do not have to be outside in this weather. And that's because of the threat of black ice. The weather is getting, uh, the temperature is dropping, which means that things could freeze over again. And you will not see that black ice. It's, you can't see it from when you're driving. So he's asking people to please stay off the roads if need be. Now he says that city offices as well as schools will be closed again tomorrow. Again, the high rise is closed as well as elevated levels of I-10 and right now the Danziger Bridge is open as well as the Seabrook Bridge but again he's asking people to please take precautions. Now we spoke with the Sewage and Water Board who was also at this meeting. We asked them if people have their pipes frozen over what should they do? Here's what he had to say. The first thing is um, they can try thawing the pipes uh, using a hair dryer as is most common. Uh, just try and get get it some some low heat to to the area and try and if you've identified where the where the freeze has taken place, if you discover you had a broken pipe, um, that's when if if you've thought it out and you have a broken pipe, please uh, close your uh, close the main the main valve to your house. Now, we also spoke with the RTA. They said some limited bus lines are open at this point, but the streetcar line remains closed. Now, again, you just mentioned that breaking news. We're going to head to that meeting. I have more for you coming up tonight on Eyewitness News at 630. Reporting live at City Hall, I'm Carice Jackman, Eyewitness News.